Hello everyone and uh, welcome back to another episode uh, or for the new viewers welcome to the channel so this time before we actually start with the intro and the video I would like to thank all of you guys for the comments and the subscriptions it uh, is a huge deal for us to see so many people liking our comment and liking on how we search for tarantulas in the field so Basically within two months we grew the channel from zero to over 220 subscribers so this is amazing to see and uh, basically this will be the last video from Sultanate of Oman and when you see the video itself we will already be on a plane to a completely different country. Um, the next country will be somewhat special because we will search for real hobby classic species so species you always will or probably already keep back at home and uh, hopefully we'll find some of them and can document them in the nature so please leave a comment on what you want to see in future videos do you want to see more like how we tickle tarantulas out do you want to see how we prepare for the trip do you want to see where we actually stay and what kind of hostels, like when we are camping, what we do? So just pause the video for a second and uh, make a comment with uh, your suggestion or the idea you want to see in upcoming videos. So that would be great for us and uh, we'll see us in the next video on a completely different continent and now have fun with the video. southern part of Oman actually about 100 kilometers next to the border of the country of Yemen um, at this specific place we're going to look for a blue tarantula a blue legged tarantula um, I got this information from Dimitri from South Africa he runs the tarantopedia.com site so you should check it out and uh, we'll continue searching revision of Ishnocolus was in 2014 by Guadanucci and Bent. Um, they, so they revised the whole genus of these Middle East Ishnocolus species and the ones from Europe. And this species which occurs here should be an all new species to science. So um, it is known for like five, six years now. There were some specimens found by some herpetologists from Italy and we try to find of course some specimens to like take some pictures and videos of it so we'll continue searching and maybe we're lucky but it's actually brutally hot here we have about 35 degrees most likely but it's uh, measured in the shadow so in the Sun which we are right now it's extremely hot so we are happy and lucky to have some uh, wind here at least but uh, so far we have no signs of any animals here so we'll continue and maybe we'll find something Yeah, so normally you'll find some uh, fresh water springs but uh, here in this valley there's just simply no water so uh, I'm not 100% sure if the locality data we got is uh, accurate enough because the radius 
was about 1.2 kilometers where the specimen was found so it uh, literally could be anywhere around here and uh, we checked of course the map with the Google Maps and stuff so we checked the satellite images for uh, green places but uh, sadly there, there is no so um, we will continue searching and uh, let you guys know if we find anything. So yeah, as you already seen, uh, we have not found any blue-legged tarantula on this location in Oman. So either way, it was a fun day of searching, even though it's purely vacational trip here in Oman. So as I mentioned in the intro, be prepared for the next country because there, there will be no vacation time for us. We will poorly search for tarantula species and uh, hopefully we'll find a few more. So what you also see in this video is that we will always tell when we fail and when we have success. So you will get the real deal, uh, of course, or we hope that we are going to find a few specimens more, which we can film and uh, document in the nature. So have a fun weekend and see you guys next week on Friday.